Hello, my friends, and welcome to today's video break. Psalm 41, verse 6 says, When one of them comes to me, he speaks falsely, while his heart gathers slander. Then he goes out and spreads it around. Now, David is talking about, of course, his enemies, and he doesn't want his enemies to overcome him. So, But listen how the way this enemy, particular enemy, is working in David's life. In David's life. First of all, the enemy creates some sort of lie. And when that lie begins to formulate in his mind and his heart, it affects his heart and slander begins to take over. And then once slander takes over, it justifies why, why he can go out and try to ruin David's relationship. He did this. Now, friends, you might think, well, I don't lie about others. Just be cautious because lying could be even twisting, even twisting the truth enough to make yourself look better and somebody else look worse. That, you know, the enemies were so jealous and so angry about David's, what David had that they didn't have. And sometimes that gets in. And so people want to ruin each other's reputation. So one looks better than the other. It's weird how that gets in. But I do know that we live in this kind of world. We're not, we're in it. But I, I you know, my, my, my heart is trying to keep us from getting to a place where we allow lies to formulate in our work, in our in our mind first starts there about other people just for the fact because once it starts well if i say this even though it's not true then what you're going to end up doing what i'm going to end up doing is slandering that per- that person's reputation it hurting them you know, God calls it, it, it just destroys. It tries to destroy. And so that's an interesting technique in the enemy world is to get us, get our eyes onto other people so much so that they bother us so much that we want to lie about them. Now, you can't, you can't any more than David could control the lies that were being said about him. But what you and I can do is control the way that we, the words that we speak about other people. Are the words that we are saying about other people true, kind, and loving? You know, we're going to keep ourselves clean and free if we, if we, had, if we allow that space to truly happen. So think of the words that you say about others every day. Are they words that, that breed kindness, that just show love? You, my friends, have a blessed day using your words of kindness. <laughs>